great last day of Looney Tunes. This is our dumbbell version or our minimal equipment version of Elmer Fudd in Elmer Fudd. So with that, this is a fight gone bad style workout. That means it is a working your way through solid for the minute, each minute with a, a different rep. We accumulate our total score of all our reps. We're going to do three rounds of four minutes of work, one minute of rest. So minute number one on our timer set up like an EMOM style. Minute number one, you're going to grab that dumbbell, single dumbbell, and it is box step ups. It's as many box step ups as you can do in the minute. I don't care if you alternate, whatever you need to do. Just know that when you get to the top, hips are at full extension every time. Open up all the time. Okay. Again, you can hold that dumbbell here at your side. If you find it easier on your shoulder, if you want to hold it on your back, it doesn't matter. Whatever is going to be the easiest for you to transition out of, but to get as many box step ups in one minute. Minute number two comes. We move immediately into goblet squats. So goblet squats, that's holding that weight in front of us, right? And nice tall chest, knees out over the feet and standing that up. So in one minute, we're going to do as many goblet squats as we can do, all right? So minute two, as many goblet squats as possible. Keep counting. Minute number three, we go in to flutter kicks. Flutter kicks, laying on the ground. Hands up off the ground and nice strokes with those legs, each leg, okay? You're going to do as many flutter kicks as you can do in minute number three. After you're done minute number three, you will immediately move into as many burpees as you can do in the minute. So proper burpee form, we're here, we're flopping down on the ground, right? Chest to the ground every time, we're popping up. Hand, jumping up, clapping. Okay, let's try to make sure when we're doing those burpees that when we go down, by flopping, we save our shoulders and our arms, right? If we, when we're coming down, we do like a push up every time, your arms are gonna get more sore and more tired. So, by doing more of a flop, we're actually saving energy. I know you don't think of that when you're doing burpees. As well, when we're doing our pop up, right? A wider leg might make it easier if you have any kind of hip mobility issues. So, or an arrow, whatever's easiest for you. The other thing, when we come up out of that burpee, right, and we're popping, we're opening up every time and clapping overhead. We're not here, okay? We're not staying bent over and clapping like this. That's not a finished round. You gotta, you gotta open up every time, okay? as well. If those burpees are too much for you, you do have that sprawl option. Okay? Every time, opening up, jumping up and clapping. That's minute number four. Minute number five comes up, go record your score, get your drink then, that's your rest recovery, because you're going to do two more rounds of that. So three total rounds, four minutes of work, one minute of rest each round. Good luck. Push the pace, push the pace hard because you've got a minute of recovery and it's only 12 minutes of work this morning.